Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We're gearing up for our 30-year kickoff next week, but with close to 500 shows ah. in our rear view, Woo. we want to circle back and reflect on some of our favorite moments. All week, we'll take a look back at some of the moments that have made us laugh, made us cry, and earned a special place in each of our hearts. So mm -hmm. I'm going to get us started with a few of my faves. <laughs> okay. Starting off with our very first show and our very first guest, Wendy Williams. Yes. 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 Our first guest needs no introduction. Please welcome the best friend in my head, Miss <laughs> Wendy Williams. Yes. Yes, God. Oh, God. Yes. to get people to open up like never before. And give all the tea. And give all the, the tea. Give you know I watched the show you had P. Diddy on there, honey. <laughs> oh, yeah. You did that. Thanks. Yeah. That was good. That was real good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. That was. Um, the, I, the key for me has been longevity yes, first. Yes. You know, somebody like Puffy, we've mm -hmm. known each other for 30-something mm -hmm. years, mm -hmm. so he knows when he's coming when he comes to the show. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Um, uh, gee... You have to be a conversationalist. You do. Mm -hmm. It's really not about an interview. It's about having a conversation Absolutely. with somebody. Yeah. Love yeah. that. And, and, and listening. I, I tell folks all the time, if you can listen to somebody, you can yep. continue to have a great interview. Wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My goodness. That I was enjoy, awesome. I, listen, I enjoyed having her here. She was so much fun. She you know, was. Especially behind the scenes. You know, we yes. had an opportunity to talk and just chat it up. She is absolutely amazing. Yeah, yeah. man. Yeah. yeah. That was a good one. For our first show ever mm -hmm. right. to be her, so it was fantastic. Yeah. Well, she showed it, a lot of love to the circle. Absolutely, yeah. she yeah. did. Well, it was no easy task picking these moments, so we've mm. had some great ones along the way. Uh, but my next moment gave me a lot of pride and joy, and all of us full of, uh, you know, a little cuteness. Let's circle back to when my baby girl, Carter Starr, cooked some candy sushi with me on our Ooh. Mother's Day week a couple of years ago. <laughs> and today, joining me in the kitchen is our baby girl. What is your name? Carter. Carter! This is Carter Starr. Welcome to Sister Circle. Are you excited? Yes. You've been wanting to do this. Remember, what did you tell me to tell my manager or ask my manager? Can I be on the show? Can you be on the show? Well, today is your day. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, we're about to do this. Obviously, if you're making this with your kids, if you're cooking at any type of food, you have to do what first? Wash your hands. Wash your hands. All right, so you wash your hands, right? Yes. Okay, okay, cool. So we're going to do this. So why is this so? Why do you like doing this so much? Card, are you going to form the sushi? There you go. Um... Because I get to do it with you. Oh, well, yeah, that's a good reason to get to do it with me. That's awesome. Oh. Let me tell you, Carter oh. knows the right answers. She yes. does. That was so oh, precious. So How did you feel watching that back? I Shiny know, money. because she's about to like have her 10th birthday on she Wednesday. Is. Yeah. So she's turning 10, and she was like, I think, 8 there, 8, eight or 9. But um, yeah, or just turn 9. Mm -hmm. But yeah, just to be able to share moments with her. She always wants to come down to Sister Circle. Yeah. She mm -hmm. loves y'all so much. We, we love, love her, too. Yes. 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 Quiet doing it. Is Trina <laughs> back today? <laughs> when Celine? <laughs> coming back to the oh. show like like she's always very much I love it. in tune with it but to be able to share those moments with her is Absolutely. awesome yes. so we have a big party going on this week she's my baby that i can do all the little fun stuff mm -hmm. with because bailey's like i don't need any of that so we get we're doing carter's cool carnival for her oh, birthday that's so much this fun. weekend are you gonna have corn dogs N not corn dogs but we're gonna have cotton candy, cotton candy and snow cones mm. and big okay i like snow cones i and might i stuff. might pull up mm. carter oh you might I pull up i might pull up you would love it and funnel cake we're gonna make oh, I love those too. Gonna be Maybe fun. I can bring my own. Um, okay. Well, why don't you cook the dogs. Fun? Okay. Yeah, I know. Okay, cool. All right. <laughs> and this last moment brings it full circle from cooking with my mother to actually cooking for, cooking with my daughter to cooking for my mother. So we sat down to eat, but our conversation ended up being a food for our souls. You know, it is good, mommy, that we can spend Mother's Day together. You know, life is short. You gotta savor the moments. You're not gonna cry, are you? <laughs> no, man. <laughs> oh, See? okay. See? My mom's not very sensitive. Are you sensitive? Yeah. You try to play hard, though. She works. She said, yeah. <laughs> oh, my 
my choice? No. She's like, yeah. yep, I try to play hard. I try to play hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was a good moment for, for us to be able to kind of show our relationship and kind of broadcast it and really see each other, yeah. like really just from the same lens, just like having those similar conversations and knowing some of the experiences that we both have shared mm -hmm. together as well. So, I mean, I know how much you both of you love yeah. your mothers oh, as yeah, well. Yeah, and yeah. just yeah. being able to have that sit down was it was great. Yeah, it's, it's really great that. when you have those conversations with your mom, when you've learned that you've segued between mother-child yes. and to mother-grown daughter. Yeah. You know, the whole perspective changes, the conversation changes. It's just yeah. a world. Yeah. And then that, I, I got to tell you, I added additional change onto it. What you, what, what you? My mom is like my little baby. Uh -oh. So I got to treat her like my little baby, like, what are you doing? Okay, no, 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 you're not gonna work. I got it. Oh, really? Do that. When did that change though for you? You know, um, I just always felt like I was her protector. I don't care. I was, you know, eight years old, like all about my mom. Yeah. You know, I love my father. You guys know that too. But uh, I just always felt like, you know, she's so sweet. She's so, you know, my mom is a little docile mm -hmm. and, you know, but me, I'm not. No, no, no. no. So, <laughs> so, you know, I'm like, okay, I gotta take care of her. You gotta you know, take care, and, right. And, I, and that's how I feel. I just feel like um, I'm completely responsible for her and uh, I, stepped up to play. My dad actually trained me that way. Mm -hmm. he, he would tell me when I was a little girl, if anything ever happened to mm -hmm. me, then you have to be responsible mom. for the family. Yeah. And I, I gladly take on that responsibility. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right. Well, my mom has definitely taken care of me still to this day. Well, to this day. <laughs> Appreciate your show. <laughs> show <you. laughs> Once a woman, twice a child. Come on, man. Come on now. We're so blessed oh. to be able to evolve right before yes. your eyes every single day as we inspire and empower you we inspire and empower ourselves. Absolutely. Tomorrow we're circling back to Trina's favorite moment since joining the circle and celebrating our journey all week. But don't forget, we want to hear from you. So send us your favorite moments at Sister Circle TV and tune in to see if your moment made the cuts. We'll be right back.